story here is the Al Bayt Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Portugal facing Ghana. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Regain possession. He's in with a chance. Is it going to be? In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. Back underway, 1-0 it is. And a timely intervention. Might be a chance here. An important challenge, but they must remain organised. Sulemana. Andre Ayu. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Can he do it? Goal! Taking it from the spot and finding the target. So back underway following the equaliser. Well timed tackle. Parse. Good use of advantage by the referee. Now, who can he play it to? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Might jump in front. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next, and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, lacking a bit of inspiration with that free kick attempt. Well, lacking inspiration and lacking a bit of quality as well. That's a really poor effort. Mohamed Kudus. And a strong tackle. And Ronaldo Silva has it but really sticking to the task defensively. Now the manager has been up to the middle of half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. One advantage with them. Referee says play on. Well, the second foul after the first one, and so no advantage there, free kick. Must take the lead here. Well, they've sought, can't miss, sure. Oh not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range, he should be scoring, and he knows it. Partey. Baba. Thomas Partey. On attacking possibilities. And that play stopped. It is a free kick. Partey. Can he get them in front? Well, here it is again. And I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with. But where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets the ball first, and it's a good finish. So the ball is moving again. Will there be a quick response from Portugal here? There needs to be. Cristiano Ronaldo is looking for the right moment for that final pass. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Pointed strongly to win the ball. Is it going 
going to end up being productive for them. But quick thinking defensively. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. And a tiny challenge. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. He plays it short. minutes left possession lost intercepted How can they find a late leveler this could square the game He hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional moment. On the scent of a winner late in this game. Can he put them in front? He's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a play he is. And the final whistle has sent in. It is a victory on match day one for the home side. And Stuart, you can't really argue with that. Yeah, it's so vital.